than any disease in modern history. This foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. All right, we in this bitch. Um, this game looks good. That game look good. Uh, I want to start by saying, oh my god, my nose. That's not what I want to start off by saying. Uh, <laughs> what I want to start by saying is that uh, I want to try something a little bit different. Skip the whole intro shit, just get straight to the game. But not only that, I haven't touched any of the settings in this game. Well, some of my graphic settings. So I don't know how it's going to run. I'm going to probably have to fix it later, but I'm just so excited to play this game. I was just like, fuck it. I'm going to go ahead and play. Anywho, um, so I hopefully it doesn't start to tank and chug too much. Okay, I thought that was somebody. I am getting RE7 vibes from this. But not only that, I am playing on the hardest difficulty. Okay, I get it. You can change the costume. Let's see if I can even show that. Um, but I am playing on hardcore. I don't know. Uh, oh shit. Well, you can't, it doesn't let you show it in the menu, but I am playing on hardcore. You know, when I get the, uh, the ink ribbons. So, you know, that proves to you that I, that I am. But anyway, yeah, man, I'm ready for this shit. We're playing this drill. She already got the pistol ready. On the counter. Yeah, she had a fucking dream that she turned into a zombie. I mean, I was still smashed though, but you know, I'm just saying. Damn, that's just a fucked up nightmare. One more day, and I will keep her till I die. So she's looking for her brother. I'm guessing that's supposed to be a dog and two women. I don't know what the fuck she's trying to figure out, but it doesn't seem good. From what I think, 
is that I think these two women kidnapped the dog of that guy because I guess they're still upset of what he did. I don't know what he did, but he did something, damn it, and they took his damn dog. So that that's what I'm thinking. But um, no, I'm I'm gonna fix my graphic settings eventually if my frame rate continues to drop i might just try to drop some shit because i don't remember what my settings were in re2 that's the problem and i would have to load up re2 and take screenshots of pictures of that shit and then fucking come in here and do it but i kind of as a matter of fact let me go ahead and, and fix something right now okay hopefully that helped i have no idea if it did or not but we'll see jill's report so I'm just going to keep these on the screen for a couple of seconds so you guys can read it at your own pace. Uh, you can just pause the video. I'm not going to like fucking fly through them so you can get all the context. I should be reading this myself to be real with you, but fuck all that. So I kind of got the gist of that. They're talking about the Raccoon City incident, or maybe they're talking about Chris them. I think they were talking about the Raccoon City incident because they were talking about people turning into zombies. I'm about to say, either she got her window open or the physics in this game were going fucking bananas. Talking about goddamn Umbrella. Talking about they probably behind that shit. And they're not wrong. That's the thing. I wonder who that was about. I know she wasn't writing a letter to herself. Yeah, that pizza does not look very appetizing. That soup doesn't look appetizing. But enough of the bullshit. Let's actually fucking get into this game. Can I go into the bathroom? Yes, I can. Left my damn sink on. That got us out the first person. I ain't gonna lie. I remember when they first showed this off. I thought Jill looked kind of funky. I was like, she looks weird. Oh, she's getting a phone call? Was that a phone call? She just said, who could this be? I oh, guess yeah, somebody is calling me. Hold on. I need to see what's in the refrigerator. I haven't eaten all day. Raccoon milk. That sounds fucking disgusting. Who the fuck would want to eat, like, eat or drink something called raccoon milk? That just doesn't sound right. Uh, what the fuck is the phone even at? talking about i don't have time to explain you gotta get out of there right now all right let me grab my ah! I'm about to say, what the fuck? You think a door is going to be able to hold that nigga when he just busted through a whole ass wall? Woman, this man literally just ran through a whole ass wall. And you keep on thinking doors and shelves are going to keep that nigga safe? I mean, keep him uh, blocked? Nah, 
ain't gonna get no help, my nigga. You better fucking jump. I see you, Capcom, sliding them nice ass shots. I see you. I ain't complaining, though. God damn. I like got a whole bunch of herbs right there. Hey, grab that shit. All right. This game looks fucking great, though. God damn, Nemesis. Chill out, my nigga. Fuck. God damn, bro. This opening. This opening. When I tell you I haven't seen anything of this game, I haven't seen a solid fucking... A solid. Solid. Let's say single. You okay? What was that? Him to I know. But right now it's got a hard on to the only two stars left in town. You and me. I'm not sticking around. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. You're dead. You don't need this no more. Oh, wow. First thing I do is miss. It's probably not smart to sit here and waste all my ammo. I just now thought about that. The game told me to draw and fire, so that's what I did. Is there a crouch button now? Or do you just run, just crawl on the shit? Yeah, you just crawl on the shit. Oh, no, you don't, you fuck. Nah, what it sound like to me is that you just want to be locked up in that truck. That's what it sound like to me. You a weird nigga and you use this as an excuse. It's like it's not safe out there. So I'm gonna hide in this truck. It's like, hey, you know you can hide like anywhere else. No, 
I'm going to hide in this truck. Like, all right, nigga. Okay, so now you can equip the knife to a weapon wheel thing. Dope. Wow, even the doges. Fuck, out of here. Well, that was in RE2, so what the fuck am I talking about? But this is what I was going to say. Nemesis during that opening sequence. It's like he took that one moment in the regular RE2, or original RE2, where uh, Mr. X busted through the wall, and Nemesis in this game is like, I can do that times 100. I'm going to bust through 100 walls. I'm going to bust through the floor. I'm going to bust through every goddamn thing here. And it's like, oh, shit. No. Oh, wow. Oh, come on with the bullshit. You just opened up two seconds ago. You already know that shit ain't happening. But you know who about to fuck that shit up. My nemesis is like, it's my turn, bitch. I think we're in the clear. What's so? We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. Safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. Sorry about that, dude. I... This is dipshit to close to again. Sorry, we're gonna have to go around. What do you know about that monster? Nothing. I just 
and they can like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that in a man? No, sir. I'm going in. <laughs> I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the umbrella biohazard county officer. The DCS is shit. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? We're just here to help you. What's wrong with Umbrella? What's wrong with Umbrella? Oh my god. Your company is responsible for infecting everyone! Yeah. I don't know anything about all that. So you don't have to trust me. But I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Come on. This way. Shout out the Dino Bites. So tasty, they make you go extinct. Damn. Red and yellow. Be sure to brush your teeth after eating. Uh, no, but I didn't mean for the game to fuck up. What happened was, there's this thing that I have on my computer that makes it easier for me to use controllers. And it updates. Uh, or it always gives me a notification that it's checked for updates. And that's what happened. As I was in the middle of that fucking cutscene, it popped up and it fucked up and the game paused and all this extra shit. And I fucking hate that because I'll let the computer sit on for about 45 fucking minutes and the shit will never pop up. But as soon as I'm doing something, it's like, hey, we just made sure that there's no updates for this program. And it's like, fuck you, dude. But yeah, they made Carlos like hella badass, bro. Like, I ain't gonna lie, I'm kind of fucking with Carlos. She is an elite operative of RTD Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is Something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, the team leader, Mikhail Victor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. How's that going? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the 100,000 civilians will wind up dead, or correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. So you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get the subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. Or we need help. My men cannot do this alone. All right. I'm in. But I want first. Not your men. Oh, baby. Cool. We all want the same thing. I know what awaiting you. Oh, for the first in the pit. You need to get your gear up. Head up this street, Lowe. You'll find supplies there. Alright. Damn, <laughs> made Jill a little wise cracking smart ass. So that's gonna make motherfuckers love her even more. Because people always love Jill. Personally, Jill's never been my favorite character. I've never really understood why. But honestly, how they have her in this game, I kind of can see why. I kind of, I, I, I kind of fuck with Jill. Now, not fully, but, um, you know, to me, Ada's always going to be top tier. Whether it's Remake or RE4 Ada, Ada's always going to be top tier. Okay, so that's just the basics about mixing shit. Oh, comic books. Living Corpses. Mega Man. The Great Gladiator. Fighting Story. Piracy. Under Waves. Or Under the Waves. Some of these look kind of cool. Hmm. 
Big E. I don't know why when I hear Big E, I think about a black dude. Like it's Big E. Everybody run. Anyway. But yeah. I'm probably here in a little bit. Probably not. I'm saying it now, but most likely I'm not. I'm going to try to figure this setting shit out so the game can run a little bit smoother. Because I've been dipping in certain areas. But it could just be day one shit. Because I remember that's what happened with RE2 when that came out. Day one, it wasn't... It was optimized, but it wasn't fully optimized. And then after a while, it became hella good. Hmm. So the public don't know. I think it's just some weird fucking disease. Gunpowder. Gunpowder. Herb and herb. Oh, that's the dodge mechanic. Holy shit. Why don't they tell you about that? This is the best fucking thing to ever happen to this game. I swear to you it is because that's what was pissing me off in RE2. So if there's a zombie trying to reach for you and you're running, you can easily just do this and, and you get out that way. Oh, I need a key for that, of course. So, how do I use my knife now? If this is the dodge mechanic, oh, hey, yo, hey, okay. Or I could just do that. That's always easier. Just drag and drop. I like the rehaul of the, the menu screen, too. It's, it's, it's a little bit better. It's a, it's a little bit better. Um, oh, let's see. What should I do now? What, sh what should I do now? Should I go ahead and combine the green herbs, or should I leave them? I know one thing I am going to do. Oh, the save room. LS save room. See, it says it right there. Game mode, hardcore. That's how you know I wasn't fucking lying. It says it right there. But where's the ink ribbons? That's the thing. That's the only thing I don't get. Where's the fucking ink ribbons? That's that's what I need to know. Did they take away the ink ribbons? I guess they did. I don't know. But it says it right there. It says hardcore. So I'm not lying. Told you I wasn't lying. 